Van Dijk away. What a great hit! Brady whips it in, swag up, swag up, won't count. Ashley Barnes is celebrating, but not. Van Dijk has stayed forward. Keita find a little hole, got the shot away to one of those five. Tarkovsky at the back post. Oh, Allison! It's in from Jack Cork! Burnley lead! Jack Cork breaks the deadlock. Liverpool can play, but Burnley lead. Tarkovsky with pretty much a free header. Feeding Origi. James Milner through the crowd and into the net. James Milner equalises for Liverpool. 61 played, 1-1. Absolute precision from James Milner. Just certainly closer to the box. In it goes, clipped in around the back. Van Dijk and in from Firmino. Liverpool are in front. And I do believe that is Firmino's first touch since he came on the pitch. Three minutes on the pitch. Salah once more. Keita, great block in there. Back in by Henderson. Keita and off the corner kick. Up go the heads. Ben Lee got something on it. Lee! Oh, tremendous. Clipping it on to Mohamed Salah. Shakiri's in the middle. He can win the game here, and he has. Burnley one, Liverpool three. Gerard Shakiri. Great counter-attack, started by Liverpool's goalkeeper. Well, Alisson didn't stop to... ...in the middle, delayed the cross. Oh, brilliantly played, though. In the end, the goalkeeper could... ...was left his cheek. It's a shot away, it's deflected, it's in. Has to go down as an own goal. They've given Hazard too much room up to now. After she got the shot away, definite own goal for me. Like it. Did it well enough? Oh, what a splendid save. And over to Willian, chance here right at the end of the half for Chelsea. He's miscontrolled it, but he got the shot away. No, he didn't. Now he's gone on the overlap, perfectly timed. Lovely ball, beautiful cross. Kante might have a shot. Does have a shot. It's a rarity. White. Away from Fabregas. Purposeful play. Jimenez. It's 1-1. Poor goalkeeping, he doesn't care. Went straight through Kepa, who's had nothing to do. It's their first shot on target, and they scored from it with 58 minutes on the clock. Well played to Moutinho. Doherty with the cross, it's 2-1 to Wolves! Chota! He's turned the game on its head. Coutinho to Doherty, how about that for a cross? And that's our plenty of old gold shirts back in there. They couldn't stop him getting right up. That's a bigger cross in. Comes out of Fabregas. So straight into the middle from Torreira. What a chance. Was that over the line? And the referees had a look at his watch and decided it was. It's an Arsenal goal. Skodran Mustafi has headed in for the Gunners. Manchester United are going to have to do it from being behind again if they're going to get something from the... It's Rojo, it was a good try. And the ball is kept in, and now it's put in by Martial. And Herrera kept it alive. Anthony Martial finished it off. Not a flicker. Plenty of noise around Old Trafford. Gave the ball straight to Lacazette. Mkhitaryan, Lacazette! And it's gone in. Arsenal were thinking about asking for the penalty. Better than that, they've got a goal. Marcus Rojo with a monumental error. Arsenal have their lead back. As Lukaku goes in at the other end, and Lingard is in at the other end. Straight from kickoff. They weren't down for long. Well, that was instant. What an incredible sequence of events. Arsenal's turn to look doozy. Kolasinac, here's Aubameyang! Kolasinac, right across the face. Aubameyang, only Lacazette up there with him. Aubameyang! It's really piling on the pressure now. Mkhitaryan waltzing. Oh, what a good save. What? 
Mkhitaryan from the most important... ...now looking for Trippier once again. Trippier in, Son first time! Smacks the post! Quick and short and into Kane! And Southampton are behind inside ten minutes. Tottenham's goal scorer once again, Harry Kane. A hat-trick in this fixture last season. Back into Hoybier. Off the post. Oh, and why? Son venturing forward and bringing the best. Towards the near post and flapped away. By Ericsson for Tottenham. Beaten away by Mc Not such a good one. Not very well cleared. Lucas Mora. Second attempt. 2-0 Tottenham. Two bites of the cherry for Lucas Mora and he makes the second one count. It's going to be a tough second half for Southampton now. Conceding fairly early in the first half and early in the second two. Lucas yeah, up against target. It's fallen kindly here for Kane. Who picks up Son Hung Min? It's 3-0. And surely no way back for Southampton now. Nine minutes into the second half. And Son Hung Min, who scored in this fix. Gabbiadini. Nathan Redmond now. And Southampton. It's drilled in by Hoybier. Double save from... Redmond's done well. Here's Austin. And another stop. Deep in added time here. Header on by Yoshida, and they hit the bar again. And here comes Charlie Austin with a great chance for a consolation goal. And Southampton, for the way they've kept plugging away, deserve to get on the board. Charlie Austin with a goal to bring a smile to the new manager's face. It will end in defeat, but Southampton... Seri any favours up towards Ianacho. Ianacho in on goal. And Rico. Seri goes long. Chambers! All Brighton to the far post. Morgan, good save by Rico. Camera still going. And Fonte the lead. Great resistance from Camera. And it's lucky 13 after going 12 league games without a goal. Three minutes before half-time, the all-important goal. Okazaki, though, for Leicester City. Okazaki to Madison. Madison with the equaliser. And Fulham is still searching for that first clean sheet of the season. First meaningful touch. We're into the first of four minutes of added on time as Damari Gray will shoot. They've plenty of pace to try and do so. The ball in was brilliant. The finish from London, equally so. And Newcastle United, with a brilliant counter attack, take the lead at Goodison Park. Really good counter attack, a brilliant ball in. Without a cross, and it comes all the way through. Oh, and all they have is a corner, and they'll score from it because Richarlison thumps it into the roof of the net. Well, Everton was still unhappy that they hadn't earned a picking points along the way. As Dinia tries to... Yedlin... Atsu... Good save... That can only mean one thing, trouble. Here goes Leroy Sané. Foster did enough. Pereira's header. De Cure, Dini that was a scare for Watford. Back in from Mares, Sane this time. Leroy Sane has now scored on four of his last five Premier League starts, and Ben Foster is finally beaten five minutes before half time. David Silva, Jesus, Mares. Clinical, his fifth Premier League goal for Manchester City. It's taken just over five minutes of the second half, and the club record signing has given them clear daylight. All for Mares. Oh, he tried to squeeze it home from Delft. De Lafayette picked his pocket. 
And then the opportunity for the Kure. Who has forced it home? No clean sheet for the champions. And Watford have reduced it to 2-1. There wasn't any problem here until Delft gave it away. Thomas man in the Amex Stadium. Little pause from Murray. Oh, in off the bar. Great penalty. And Glenn Murray does it again. He has now scored in six of Brighton's seven home games in the, in the back of the net. And marches corner into the near post. Great finish from Leon Balogun. The substitute. His first touch of the ball. His first goal for Brighton. The sweetest of right foot strikes. Look at the goalkeeper, Matt Ryan's come bombing forward against Tompkins. Tompkins on the yellow card, got to be careful here. Gets the ball, Dan Andone! Fabulous individual goal from the Romanian. Never gave that up from the word go. And 10-man Brighton lead Crystal Palace by three goals to nil at half-time. Fans behind the goal. Also wait, Milivojevic finds the bottom corner. His third goal of the season. His third from the penalty spot. And rules. It's saved. Anderson getting his header all wrong. Chance hit perhaps. 1 0. Lucas Perez with the opening goal after Cardiff made an absolute hash of clearing their lines. Numbers forward, Silmasuaku cleverly done. And Perez finds the net again. Well, the first West Ham goal was down to some sloppy play at the back from Cardiff. This owed. Good looking delivery as well. It's three. Mikel Antonio surely wraps up the points for West Ham. His first in the Premier League this season. Decided to stay. Now he has to deal with it. And hasn't done so. And Cardiff have one back. Well, it's only going to be a very minor consolation. Ogbonna with the initial header. Gunnarsson just stood his ground. Fabianski couldn't get there. Everybody forward for Bournemouth. And it's it. Callum Wilson with the header. It just had to be him. Bournemouth's top scorer gets his ninth goal of the season. Huddersfield claiming an offside here. Certainly he wants it played. Fraser's making a lovely run into the middle. It's towards Ryan Fraser, who makes it 2-0. Wonderful breakaway goal from Bournemouth. Ryan Fraser, who hasn't scored since mid-September, when he got a couple here in the 4-2 victory over Leicester, has found the goal again. Huddersfield conceding possession. Might drop here for Jorgensen, and it's in. Congolo with the goal back for Huddersfield. It's his first goal for the club, and it gives Huddersfield hope, having conceded two.